It's official. There will be no fans in the stands for the Summer Olympics. The decision coming as Japan declares a fourth COVID state of emergency for host city Tokyo. All just two weeks before the games begin. The number of infected people is clearly starting to increase, says Japan's prime minister, in part because of the Delta variant. And hospitalizations are up. The state of emergency will run from July 12th to August 22nd. Bars and restaurants will be barred from serving alcohol and must close early. Tokyo reporting 920 new cases Wednesday, the highest since May. Opposition to the games is widespread across Japan, with opinion poll after opinion poll showing the majority they want the international event called off. But Olympic organizers are still forging ahead, and some athletes already arriving and now learning spectators will be banned. We unfortunately have no other choice but to hold the Games in a limited way, explains the Tokyo 2020 president. Organizers reversing an earlier decision to allow local fans with capacity capped. Overseas spectators were already banned. In our discussions with the Canadian Olympic Committee in terms of the delegation going uh, to Japan, uh, everyone understood that it's not a, a zero risk scenario. Reaction here at home from Canada's top doctors who say athletes and other representatives are expected to follow COVID protocols in Japan. All of the athletes, I think, uh, have been or, or were offered a vaccination to be fully vaccinated before they go over for their events. We expect then the Canadian delegation um, to have that very uh, good layer of protection, but uh, nothing is completely risk-free. The Tokyo Olympics open July 23rd. Melissa Duggan, City News.